even yours up here. If you ever come across them freezing up, please call us or Forest River first. Every air conditioner has what's called a freeze sensor. And that sensor is shoved right inside the condenser and it's constantly measuring the temperature. That is what tells the compressor to shut on and off. What happens over time, that free sensor wiggles out and falls out of the condenser. So then the compressor kicks on and it's running non-stop and then it builds up a layer of ice over the condenser mm -hmm. and it's no longer circulating Especially air. when it's hot outside and we're trying to get it, keep it as cold as possible, mm -hmm. so. Yeah, you definitely want to leave it to auto. Auto's gonna automatically kick on and off the compressor and it's gonna automatically shut down the uh, air conditioner whenever it reaches 10. Mm -hmm. If we take it off of auto and say put it on cool fan, the fan is always gonna stay running on high, no matter what, even when it gets to temp and shuts down the compressor, the fan's always gonna be on. So the auto feature controls the fan aspect, turning on and off, and also the compressor. Um, so like I said, if, if it starts freezing up, if you notice, if you have a little thermostat that you can shoot up at the registers, mm -hmm. About 20 to 30 degree difference from ambient air is what it should be at inside the ducts. So if we're if we're ever concerned and you want to check the efficiency, that's a pretty good trick. That's what I do around here. Okay.